Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel Electro Study. This is lecture series 22, introduction to IoT dealing with crime assistant called Fog Fisver. Come let's go into the video. Please do like, share, subscribe and comment. Fog Fisser is nothing but Fog Framework for Intelligent Public Safety in Vehicular Environments. Obviously, when you are seeing about a vehicular IoT infrastructure built, we ensure some public safety environment. That is why we have entered into Fog Fisser. So this fog fissure will ensure about the smart tra transportation safety like whether internally and externally in the environment it ensures that the transportation safety is maintained in a particular manner such that we avoid mismanagement of traffic and also the uh, uh, often occurring accidents. So here the smart transportation safety it is having a surveillance system. So this surveillance system will have camera which will capture uh, images, videos, where the captured images and the videos will be processed and the particular, uh, through the particular processed data, the deduction of criminal activities can be detected and derived in real time systems. So how it is derived as it is having a for computing architecture. So this architecture, this computing will act as a mediator between the vehicle and the police vehicle. That is the vehicle which is, uh, which is like over speeding or which hits another car or which hits another tempo. So a vehicle and a police, ve a police vehicle, between these two there is a mediator which is known as a fog computing where all these data once processed is reported. Uh, to the police agent through an application. So mobile application is developed which is given to the poli police where the police can monitor if there is any registration of crime. So this architecture is divided into three tiers wherein first tier it is divided into two batches that is image processor and event dispatcher. Image processor is nothing but crime definition downloader, crime definition storage, algorithm launcher. Event dispatcher is, among, is about the data that is gathered use when an event is triggered. And the tier 2 deals with the training of an object and notifying the particular person once the trained data set is derived. And tier 3 is nothing but it consists of a unit called crime as is where the, all the reports will be stored and derived when a crime activity is done. So seeing about the tier 1 in vehicle, uh, in vehicle whisper, so what this tier 1 does is it first detects whether any criminal activities is done or not. So once it is detected, how it is detected and communicated to the police agent. So it takes all the real time data sensed by the sensor that is sitting inside, uh, inside the vehicle. So all that sensed data will be processed so that the detection of criminal activities can be found out. So this actually this tire one will create a metadata and that data will be transferred to, uh, transferred to the next tire such that it is helpful for the crime assist unit to know about the crime activity. So here we have, we have already told that it is divided as image processor and the event dispatcher. So in image processor what it does is image processing is nothing but is equal to the human eye. Uh, how we see and detect that there is some accident happening in the road. Same wise the image processor detects the same through a camera. So here for this image processor we need deep learning. This deep learning approaches, what it does is, it will capture the image and process the image. For processing the image, we need Raspberry Pi. This is the processor we use to process the, process the image. So why we use Raspberry Pi is we get high quality of camera to be processed. So finally, what it does is, this image after processing through a processor, it, uh, once it is processed and given to the police agent, they, there, this deep learning approach plays a role where the template that is the captured image matches the image that is trained. 
because many number of vehicles with many number of number plates will be trained for this deep learning approach based on the training sets it will check for any template matching so if suppose if template matches then the uh, that that template will be stored in the image processor and tells the polis that there is a, uh, there is some criminal activity that has happened in that particular place so here for that we are uh, we are using some launchers algorithm launchers that is crime definition downloader so this is nothing but it it checks for the uh, for any crime activity that is done in particular place so that it can match the template and it also sees about the any new crime template that can occur so that that can also be stored in the particular database so now he, so now here crime definition storage is nothing but for matching the template with the trained data set it uses crime definition storage such that it will be used to store all the uh, possible crime objects save, saved as a different templates and algorithm launcher is nothing but this launcher will initiate some instance so that some algorithm takes place that matches the images or video captured by the camera you suppose if a crime object is matching a video or image then the crime activity can be confirmed using this algorithm launcher coming into event dispatcher it is actually responsible responsible for collecting all the data that is sensed by the sensors for processing the image so here you have event notifier what it does is it will completely transfer all the data to the fog fizzer so where it receives all the data uh, from the sensors that is capturing the image or capturing the parameters now in data gatherer what happens is this is this is the one which is intermediate between your event notifier and virtual sensor interface which gathers the data and stores the data with it and in virtual sensor interface where uh, you will it is not that only one sensor communicate there will be multiple sensor which which will sense the data uh, through gps gsm all those and give the data to the particular infrastructure so here this virtual uh, virtual sensor uh, it will help maintain a particular procedure to gather all the sensed data so it it uh, it keeps on uh, synchronizing with the sensors to collect the data and process the data and in tier 2 fisher sts fog infrastructure this tier it is responsible for uh, updating new templates such that event when any other events occurs which is not matching the uh, old template that can be done so here target object training it is responsible for creating uh, storing and updating whenever the templates is required and it, it uses an algorithm launcher which uh, which is already used in the tier 1 this this algorithm launcher such that it can yeah, it can launch data and matches the template based on the color radius in shape format and it can also form a new database where new object definitions can be stored and notification factory is nothing but it receives all the notification about the even events where there is a crash occurred or where there is a mismanagement of traffic has occurred all those it will be notified and it receives some valid information it doesn't simply uh, give away information valid information will be sent so hope you have understood this topic please stay tuned for more information thank you